But now we want to try to go out there. And this was great. I don't know if you got a chance to watch Sunday Morning Futures yesterday with Maria Bartiromo. It's the only Sunday show worth watching. And she had on a guest, Stephen. I Maria. You she's like my her? Favorite. Yeah. Always, yeah. She's, she's great. great. She's been on top of a lot of this stuff. Now, I'd say she's not perfectly on top of everything, but she's been on top of a lot of good stuff. She had on a special guest, Stephen Schrage, who's tied in with Stefan Halper, the walrus, the guy who was at Cambridge uh, and uh, basically set up the. Um, spying on George Papadopoulos, which we've told you about before, as well as on General Flynn. Now, this is something very interesting that came from the show. I could already see we're running out of time. We're not going to get to run all of these clips for you. But one that I really wanted to play for you is this guy, Stephen Schrage, recorded something with Stefan Halper, and he recorded this. This is two days before it becomes announced uh, in the Washington Post that General Flynn is under investigation. So the voice, the primary voice you'll hear here is Stefan Halper, the one who's responding is Stephen Schrage. Listen to what Halper has to say about General Flynn. If you go in the NSC, you have to, uh, you have to consider very carefully mm-hmm. uh, if you feel it's, it's appropriate for you to work for Flynn or yeah. you want to work with. I don't think Flynn's going to be around long. Yeah. Oh. I mean, that's just my guess. But, right, uh, right. The way the thing, these things work, you inevitably find yourself at odds with someone. Yeah. yeah. I mean, you always do. Yeah, yeah. Probably lots of people. Right. And when your opponents, so we we'll call them enemies, but when people right, oppose right, right. you, right. are looking for ways of uh, exerting pressure, they go to people that they know you're at odds with. Right, right. And that's how it builds, mm-hmm. and then eventually you get squeezed yeah. pretty hard. And that, that was my kind of lesson. But that. Flynn's reaction to that is to blow up and get angry. Yeah, yeah. He's really, I don't know where we're going to go somewhere. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But that is his reaction. Right. That's why he's so unsuitable. That little blip there, we had to, we had to cut a little bit there because he was cussing. Oof. Bad old walrus. The bad walrus. You know, we're going to have to jettison because there was some other talk about how did Halper know that Flynn was about to be derailed from his post on the National Security Council. And Schrage says he doesn't know for sure that he knew, that Halper knew, but that it sure was suspicious and caught his eye. But here's what Schrage says is the real smoking gun in all this. And it's the fact that nobody has been called and questioned about any of this by any of the authorities. That's what we were some of what we were telling you about earlier with Lindsey Graham. The key part, and I think the real smoking gun in all this, is you know all these tentacles lead back to this small group, including Stefan Halper at the center of Spygate, Christopher Steele at the center of Russiagate, Stefan Halper's FBI handler. None of the Senate has subpoenaed these or called these people to talk in four years. I think that's the real smoking gun. How are these people being protected? And how are we at a point so close to the election and with Flynn's hearing coming up that no one has called these people and gotten to the bottom of this? Well, and then he talks about the fact that he has actually talked to John Durham and the Durham investigation. And then he told him he couldn't wait. Their investigation has taken too long. He had to go public before the Flynn hearing. Listen, this will be the last clip we play on Schrage. I did. And, and I did tell him a couple weeks ago, I said, you know, I'm happy to continue to help, but I need to go public because I'm concerned about how long this is taking. This shouldn't be political about Democrats or Republicans. This is about officials undermining our democracy, and it needs to be known yeah. long before the election. Go out there and check out that interview yesterday from Sunday Morning Futures with Maria Bartiromo, the interview of Stephen Schrage. It was toward the end of the program. He's a special undisclosed guest. They just gave notice of it right before the program went live. This is the first TV interview that he's done. Is the one he did yesterday. So this is the first time that he's come forward to tell his story. He was right at the center of it. He was right at the center of inviting Carter Page. He was right at the center of dealing with General Flynn and Stefan Halper. He wasn't involved, he says. And I think if you watch him, you know, he doesn't seem like he was involved. He seems like he's a innocent actor. But he's got some real stories to tell, and we're glad some of the truth is finally coming out. Hopefully it'll have some kind of effect on these ongoing proceedings against General Flynn. Folks, thanks for joining us. I'm Morgan Streetman, and that's the way I see it. Thank you for listening to The Morgan Streetman Show. We hope you enjoyed what you heard, and if you did, please click like and subscribe to help us out. 
And remember that we recommend that you exercise your brain at least once a week.